speak right up. Looking to find a friend. Somebody close to lend you a hand. Help you to understand. What's wrong, Julie? I... I think I have head lice. Well, why don't you come over here and we'll check for sure. Well, Julie, you were right. You do have head lice. But don't worry. Every year, millions of people get them and they're cured in no time with the proper treatment. Can you see them? They're very small and hard to see. It's easier to see the nits. Hide the nits! Hide the nits quickly! They can't be hidden! Remember, they're stuck on! This is what a nit looks like under a magnifying glass. And this are what lice look like. But in real life, they're close to the size of a sesame seed. But how did they get on me? I always wash my hair. Unfortunately, that has nothing to do with it. A lot of times it happens because your hair rubs against someone who has head lice. Or your head may just have touched something like a pillowcase or a towel that someone with lice has already used. Perhaps you left your coat on top of someone else's who has lice. Or there are times when we share things we shouldn't, like brushes, hats, caps. I guess I should have told you sooner, but I was afraid of what my parents and friends might think. It's like any problem, Julie. Often the hardest part is to tell someone else. But don't worry, I'll explain to your parents. It's not your fault or theirs. Anyone can get head lice. It's sort of like catching a cold. But now I can't be in the play. Of course you can. I tell you what. If we work with your mom or dad and do everything right, you can be back in school and in that play tomorrow. Really? Sure. Now, the first step is to make sure everyone in your family check each other for lice. And then, this is what we're going to do to get rid of the lice on you. We start with a special treatment that kills the lice hiding in your hair. This is an all-out assault. Run for your life. Stop and stop! and I'll hide out in the pillowcase. The treatment will kill the lice in your hair, but the nits have to be removed carefully with a special nit comb. You must get all the nits. Otherwise, they'll hatch and then you'll have the same problem all over again. Before you can come back to school, we have to make sure that all the nits are gone. Then, most importantly, your mom or dad must keep checking for nits every day for two weeks. You should soak all your combs and brushes in very hot water. Lice can live away from someone's head for many hours and the nits for even longer. So be sure to wash and dry your clothes, sheets and blankets on the hottest setting. Hey! Lice command! Lice command! I gave it my best fight, but we're doing everything right! And to be really certain you've got rid of all the lice, you'll have to vacuum the house and all the furniture too, anywhere that lice could have fallen. They'll never find me here. We have suffered a major defeat. More kids and parents are banding together against us than ever before. But we will not give up, no. Not as long as people are afraid to admit we're in their hair. We're losing, but we'll give them a good fight. Right down to the last louse. Prince, the answer is clear. When you speak up, there's nothing to fear. <laughs> and so with courage, 
You can find a friend to live happily ever after. The end. Speak right up.